So congratulations for appearing on the list. Thank you very much. Um, are you pleased to see more British names appearing on the list now? I don't know. I haven't heard the results yet. <laughs> this is true. How yeah, this is very true. How would you be celebrating tonight um, if you're bumped up? Last year, which was, in my words, in, in my thoughts, was more a uh, bit of an over-promotion. I didn't expect to get as high as we did last year. I think I went home, so we had to work the next day oh, um, early. Really? But I don't know. See how I go tonight. Maybe I... Okay. Yeah, that's not going to have a bearing actually if I go out for a few beers with some friends I've made that are here and I've got to become good friends with some of the guys over the years we'll probably go, we'll go out for a drink afterwards okay there's a very multicultural atmosphere here yeah do you do you feel that in general when we're working in cooking in the cuisine industry yeah you do I mean, I mean in my kitchen we've got maybe people from nine different places around the world you know probably about 14, 15 on the roads and there's nine different places around the world that the chefs come from so I think that's generally the feel but it's so good to see so many good restaurants all around the world represented tonight mm. Over the last couple of days. Do you, in your own restaurant, do you take influences from other countries, other cuisines? Yeah, yeah, I think everyone does a little bit. You know, I'm obviously not from this country originally, um, from Australia originally, and uh, yeah, so I think it's, it all helps in mixing it up a bit. And good to see so many different people here tonight. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, thank you very much, and good, good luck. Thank you. Very